know about you, but it is so fun when you get to do something brand new. I and only, know. only in this market is right here in an AR VR studio. We're here. It's, We're here. Did it. It's going to make our Months storytelling better. I know. It's going to be so exciting. First off, just forget the weather for a second. How cool is this? This is so cool. How cool is this? It really this? is. This is a virtual set. We're in a room where it's green, left, right, up, and down. I know you can't see but that. But here's really. what computers and technology can create ah. a weather studio bigger and better than anything Southern California has ever seen. Great job, Paul. It, it, well, and all team. the people back that there, they're the ones doing it. Let's do a little happen. countdown here okay, because there's it. something, that I, there's lots of things we can show off. Here's the first one. We're going to open up the window behind Ooh. us. Okay. Countdown from five. Let's get it. Five, five four, four, three, three two, two one. one. With one push of the button, let's take you outside. Wow. Here we go. Now that is our Mount Wilson camera, it's which gorgeous. we can now present to folks in a different and better so way. So cool. So guys, thanks for joining me. This has yes, been awesome. You go. We're going we're to talk about the weather cast <laughs> now. And here's what we have going on. This is the view above the marine layer. We got to talk about the weather. This is a storytelling experience and we'll be able to tell the weather story in a better way than we've ever done before. You can see the sunshine you're going to get later on today, but chances are you are under the clouds right now. Now let's take you and I can show you the weather maps literally below my feet. This is the wind profile in Southern California right now. I want to point out that the winds are still coming in from west to east. It is still the onshore flow, but the farther you get away from the ocean because it is a light onshore flow, you're getting less of that impact. So the breeze from the ocean is still there. It's just not that strong. So in Malibu, you're going to have a big influence from it. But in places like Moreno Valley, you are not going to have a big influence. Now we can also show you our weather maps in a way that we have never done before. Uh, this is your next weather forecast. And we're talking about our weather graphics where we can show them to you wherever we're standing. They will follow us. Another cool feature about this temperature spread Laguna Beach sunshine this afternoon. 69 degrees, but because of the light onshore breeze not making it to Lancaster, it's the same sunshine, but it will be 30 degrees hotter. Now, right in between, we're going to find Los Angeles, where we're going to have our first 80 degree day in about a week and a half, 81 degrees. But now that we're warmer with less of that ocean influence, it'll be the first of seven straight days where it will be 80 degrees or hotter. We'll take you live outside. Here's Long Beach. You'll be under the cloud cover for the next couple hours, but we go above the clouds, and this is the view from Blue Ridge Mountain, where we currently have mainly sunny skies. Here are your next weather headlines. It's another gloomy start, but it will be another sunny finish. We've seen this script before. We've been kind of stuck in this pattern for a while. That wide temperature spread, 30 to 35 degrees. It will be warmer for all of us for Father's Day weekend, so we're calling it warmer for dad. Now we can actually lose this monitor by pushing one button. There it goes, and now watch this. Welcome to Southern California. Here's a view of our viewing area. Here's Metro LA County, Metro Orange County, but better than that, this is next weather future cast where we are standing in the weather and I'm able to show you where the clouds are and where the clouds are not over the next seven hours but it gets better. We can also show you today's highs. So let's take a look at a place like Huntington Beach, literally in the clouds with a high today of only 71 degrees. There's a chance you don't get that much sunshine this afternoon. But if we just head inland, Anaheim goes up to 78. Your Belinda 82. We get out toward Glendora 86 degrees, Pasadena 84. We talked about LA's 81. Now west facing beaches in LA County. Some afternoon sunshine, not much. You can see the cloud cover holding on. Santa Monica 73, Manhattan Beach 73, Woodland Hills 87, and Malibu today 68 degrees. So the clouds burning off in our inland valleys by 10 or 11 o'clock, but the clouds holding on uh, right along the coastline. Now we're going to take these things out, and I'm going to show you what's going to be going on with our extended forecast as we look forward and into the future and the upcoming Father's Day weekend. Your next weather forecast for Chino, 86 today, 88 tomorrow, 87 on Friday. Here's that ridge of high pressure to our south, not that strong. Area of low pressure to our north, not that strong. We're kind of caught right in between with that light onshore breeze. Here's another view of the clouds this morning, but the sunshine we get this afternoon. Tomorrow, Thursday morning, we'll do it again. Metro area, coast, inland valleys will have mostly cloudy skies. We'll get lots of sunshine in the afternoon, and those temperatures inland will bake. Banding up to 92, Moreno Valley 93. Next weather extended forecast, 93 is a popular number through Friday, but look at Father's Day, you're up to 98 degrees on Sunday. 
for our valleys, upper 80s, low 90s through Saturday. We lose the morning cloud cover up to 94 on Sunday. And final stop will be the metro area. Now that we're in the 80s, we will stay in the 80s with the warmest day being Sunday and a high of 86 degrees. Guys, back to you.